Hey, it's me, GV, and welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to Let's Play Fallout 3, the 100% series. Bet you didn't expect this to come back, did you? Bet you, hey, hey. Bet you didn't expect this one to come back, did you, boy? Well, it's back. Uh, if you're enjoying the series, remember leaving likes, leaving comments, subscribing with the bell turned on. It all helps out this channel and series to grow. If you want to go the extra mile, check out the Patreon and Twitch links in the description below. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. Hello, Caron. I don't like the look of this place. Why is that, my friend? You're fired. Let's go. And I shall follow. Yes, you will. Uh, what the heck were we doing? Tab to open our pit boy, right? Quest to open our quest, right? Bring Dave's key. Optional kill. Mr. Crowley. Boo -boo -boo. Won't you open your head? Bring Ted Strayer's key. Bring Dukov's key. So, yeah, we did all the stuff. Uh, but what about the... What about the election? Let's wait. You cannot wait in this. Why can't I wait in this location? What? It's very weird. Can I wait here? Uh, 6.04 a.m. Let's wait four hours. Four, five, six hours until noon. And then we'll see if we can't interact with the election. Uh, if we remember right, there was an election happening. Uh, hey there. Hi there. Play with us? Yeah, what's up, Flower? President Daddy says the people What's up, Mary? Are you are really from what's the up, Shauna? So, Dave gave you the okay, huh? Well, welcome then. I run the Museum of Dave, where the children of the Republic can learn about their heritage. Sounds very ed educational. I'd like to know more about the Republic. Sure. The Museum of Dave is happy to answer any questions on behalf of the Republic of Dave's Office of Tourism. Dave has two wives. Dave revised the restrictive marriage laws of the Kingdom of Tom shortly after the Republic was formed. Multiple marriages is now considered one of the great free freedoms of the Republic of Dave. Tell me more about this Dave guy. President Dave is the savior of the wasteland, bringing peace and order to the savages man has brought upon himself. If you would like to learn more, please stop by the Museum of Dave's official tour at 2 p.m. Okay, we'll try to make that, actually. Tell me about yourself, Shauna. Me? I just run the museum and teach classes to the little ones. You know, truth, justice, and the will of Dave. Right, of course. Truth, justice, and the will of Dave. What's your take on the Republic? The Republic of Dave offers a rich history rivaling that of the great nations before the war. Okay. Short and succinct, all of these different things. That's all I needed to know. How very Dave-like. I'd like to discuss the election with you. Me? I'm not sure if I can help you. So if you remember, uh, Dave is running an election, and he's the only one running. He's unopposed. And uh, I think you can definitely change that up. I'd like to throw my hat in the ring. Have you considered running for the presidency? Absolutely not. In fact, I'd vote for Dave twice if I could. Okay, you're pretty loyal. Uh, I'd like to throw my hat into the ring and run for presidency. Did you ask Dave if that's okay? Yeah, I think so. Let me ask you something else. Anything else? Uh, you should go vote if you haven't already. Oh, no. Dave sent you to tell me that, didn't he? I'll go right away, I promise. Okay, you go do that. Wow. I'm gonna go explore more of the Republic of Dave, which is what a... Such a... What a... Such a... Such a... Such a... What a... Such a... What a... A, a, a fine establishment here. Open ammunition box. Ooh, yeah, I will take that. Thank you. Open metal box. Pack of cigs. I will take that. Thank you. It's funny how muscle memory can, like, get you right back into the swing of things, even with a game like this that you haven't played in quite a while. Uh, they got a little bit of a swing. Apparently, we are incredibly lightweight. Uh, and then who is this over here again? We've got Hi. Flower, which we've already there? talked to. What's over here? Open door to Republic of Dave's men quarters, and it's illegal to go in there. Uh, we've got Bob. Yes? What is it? Come on, I don't have all day. I'd like to know more about the Republic. Shauna runs the museum, not me. What the hell do you want? Uh, Dave has two wives? Yes, he does, and they're both pains in my ass. Always got to keep them in line or else they get all teary. Uh, tell me more about this Dave guy. Dave made me second commander of the army of Dave, and that means I get a gun. Don't make me have to use it. So, uh, Bob, I'd like to know more about you. All you need to know is that I'm second in command next to Dave, so don't bother me. And don't talk to Rosie or Jessica either. Those are Dave's wives, and they have work they need to do. 
Okay. You're very straightforward. Uh, what's your take on the Republic? Dave is in charge. When he's not around, I'm in charge. If you want anything else, go to the Museum of Dave on the left side of the compound. I'm working on it. That's all I needed to know. Oh, great. I'd like to discuss the election with you. Oh, yeah? What about it? I'd like to throw my hat into the ring and run for presidency. Um, did Dave say you could do that? Yeah, he did. Have you considered running for presidency? Man, I'd love to be the president. Everybody would have to listen to me or I could just exile them to the wasteland. And the first thing I'd do is make myself the permanent leader so they couldn't vote me out in some other election. But there's no need for me to run. One year, Dave is just going to make me the leader, just like my grandpa Tom did for him. Dave is corrupt. The Republic needs a new champion of freedom, 45%. Uh, I don't think you should be in charge of anything. Yeah? Well, well, so's your face. Good one, Bob. Uh, you should go vote if you haven't already. Fine. I'll get out of the way. Okay. See you later, buddy boy. What is this? The woman's quarters? Door to Republic of Dave's women's quarters. Door Republic of Dave. Okay, I'm going to try to go in here if I can. Who's detecting me right now? It shouldn't track my followers as detecting me. Like, it shouldn't track that Charon's detecting me as far as I understand. So who the heck is looking my way? Who the heck is looking my way? Seriously, who the heck is looking my way? We were hidden there for a second. Okay, we're going to check the women's quarters just to see if there's any sort of bobblehead or something. I feel like there is a bobblehead in the Republic of Dave or there's some... They're probably thinking of uh, Old Faithful or whatever the heck his shotgun is. Uh, Old Painless, right? He's got a really, 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 really good, uh, really good weapon, Dave does, on him that if you steal it, uh, you can make something happen, but let's go check this. Who the heck is looking at me? There's got to be one spot. I know how Bethesda games work. There's got to be one spot where we're not detect. Who the heck? It's not Flower. I know that much. Come on now. Come on now, I tell ya. Okay, that's ridiculous. Well, maybe we can sneak in later. Uh, let's head into the Museum of Dave. Hello there, children. Uh, we've got a Chinese assault rifle and a Chinese officer sword. We've got a Chinese pistol. Is there? Yeah, -ha! there it is. Take bobblehead perception. You found a vault Tech limited edition bobblehead. The inscription on the base reads, only through observation will you perceive weakness. Your perception has been permanently increased by one. Yeah, that's a big one. Any of the uh, special stats, huge. Let's talk to these kids. Oh, we got Ralph. President Daddy says that people. From Mary. Outside President the Republic Daddy. Rachel. Yeah. President Daddy. Outside the Republic says President Daddy. Dad. President. The Republic President. Are President, are President Daddy. Okay, we're gonna wait until the tour. So that's in one hour. And let's see if we can get an Hello. official tour by uh, what's her face. It makes me feel safe Are you no really from around. the wasteland? Are you really from the wasteland? Uh, I am. Yeah. Whoa. Ruined school desk empty. Ruined school desk empty. Ruined. Ooh. Bye -bye. Something in there. Bye. Uh, where is Shauna? She should be here giving the tour. No, or maybe the. Oh, maybe the election is being held. Ah, uh, Dave. I suppose lead our republic for Dave to is glory. the patriotic thing to do. Okay, I guess you yes? have to like witness them casting their ballot. Yeah, go ahead and do that. Yo, yeah, what's up, Dave? Do you need more than that gift? Well. Uh, your republic is forfeit, prepare to be reclaimed, and that probably just initiates combat. And then everybody gets very, very angry. Uh, I do want his weapon, since it's unique, but I don't think we'll be able to get it. I heard that Dave allowed you to stay. Well, welcome, stranger. Just be mindful of the children. That's the same voice actress as, uh, Moira, isn't it? I'd like to know more about the republic. Sure, honey, but don't make it too long, or Dave will start wondering why we're talking. You're Dave's first wife, right? He has two? Well... Yes. Dave and I were married when he was wandering the wasteland, before inheriting the Republic from his father, Tom. After Ralph was born, Dave said that the President of the Republic needed to repopulate the wasteland. So, now we have a second wife. <sighs> Doesn't sound like you're too happy about that. Tell me more about this Dave guy. Dave is a good man. He looks after all the children and makes sure they have plenty to do. He's bought a lot of toys, not that he'd admit it. He has our Shauna teach classes to the younger ones. She's over at the Museum of Dave to the west of the Republic. To the west of the Republic, like literally feet outside of the front door. What can you tell me about yourself? Not much to say, really. I'm Dave's wife, or first wife, I guess. I've lived here for mm, many years now. Okay, I like how everyone's short and to the point. What's your take on the Republic? We have plenty of food and water here. 
and the compound is fairly safe. I'm glad the children can be raised here, away from the wasteland. I'd like to see more trading done with the local caravans, but Dave's afraid their outside influence could weaken the Republic. That's all I needed to know. Sure, honey. You're really nice, Rosie. I'd like to discuss the election with you. Election time is always exciting around here. Uh, have you considered running for the presidency? Oh, here we go. Believe it or not, I used to lead a group bigger than this one on an old caravan route. I did it for years, and we did pretty well for ourselves. But what am I talking about? Running against Dave would be like betraying him. Huh. You could lead the Republic into a new era, the democracy of Rosie. You're right. Dave's just been pushing me around. It's time for a change. Okay. Um, hmm. Goodbye, Rosie. Goodbye. Take care of yourself. So Rosie sounds like the one we actually want to be the leader of the Republic of Dave. So I'm going to reload this save. And then we're going to wait. Optional kill Mr. Crowley. We're going to do everything we Man, did before. Who the heck is wrong. Jessica? Dave says you're okay? Fine. Is that their second wife? Uh, Time for me to go. You should go vote if you haven't already. Okay, so yeah, we need to wait until... Let's see. T. You cannot wait. Yeah, why can't I wait in this location? It must be because they, like, cast the ballots. Okay, we're going to talk to Rosie first and then have everybody vote because I think, uh, yeah, we didn't have, we didn't even have her as an option. Okay, where's Rosie? Rosie, Rosie, not Jessica. Rosie, Rosie, Rosie. Hello. I heard that Dave allowed you to. Okay, let's run through these again. You and 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 you. No. Are you kidding me? We failed in 89%. Where did that autosave happen? Republic of Dave Capitol building. It happened after this. I think this was right when we ran inside, right? Hello. I heard that Dave allowed you to... Okay. Uh, election. I'd like to throw my hat into the ring. Um, did Dave say you could do that? Everyone keeps saying that, so I'm assuming I can. Have you considered running... And you could lead the Republic into a new era of the democracy of Rosie. There we go. I'd like to know more. You and you and you and you and you and you should go vote if you haven't already. You're right. I'll go right now. Okay, so I don't know if you can vote for yourself. But there's Rosie going to vote. We got to remember to get that bobblehead as well. Let's explore the rest of the Republic and make sure everybody is voting. And I don't think we've also talked to Jessica. Hello. Dave says you're okay. Fine. Okay. Um, I'd like to discuss the election with you. You know, run Rosie is running for president now. Poor girl doesn't stand much of a chance, does she? I mean, she could if everybody votes for her. Uh, have you considered running? No. Okay. I'd like to throw my hat into the ring. I think I get the idea. You should go vote if you haven't already. I went and voted. Good for you. Time for me to go. I may have already messed this up. In which case, that's going to suck. Do you need more than that gift? Uh, let's see. I'd like to discuss yep. the election. Are the votes in? Looks like you might have an opponent in the race, Mr. President. An opponent? Seriously? But, but, wait. No, this is a free republic. Let the people make their choice. I am confident that they will recognize me as their true and proper leader. Well, Rosie is definitely better than you. Uh, I have all the info I need. Your Republic is forfeit. I have to go now. Okay, we got to get Shauna and Bob to vote. Excuse me, Charon. We talked to you guys. We talked to Rosie. We talked to Jessica. Hello. Let's see. Got Bob over here. Yes? What is it? I'd like to know more. Dave has two wives. Tell me about the Dave guy. I'd like to know more about you. What's your take on the Republic? That's all I needed to know. Discuss the election. Rosie is running for president now. So I've heard. She couldn't possibly think that she'd be better than Dave. Uh, she is. Have you considered running? And the... F but... Uh, I don't think you should be in charge of anything. You should go vote if you haven't already. F okay, there goes Bob. Still can't go into... Oh, yeah, this was the one that we didn't... Wait, we did enter the woman's quarters, right? We didn't enter the... Didn't enter this one over here, if I remember correctly. Come on, let me inside. Let me inside. Talk to you. Are you really from the wasteland? Mm-hmm. I sure am. 
I sure am, sweetie. Let's get class started. So, Dave. Hello. Okay, I'd like to know more. Dave has two wives. Tell me more about this Dave guy. Tell me about yourself. What's your take on the Republic? That's all I needed to know. I'd like to discuss the election. If you consider running for presidency, uh, let me ask you about something else. You should go vote if you haven't already. Um, okay. Yeah. Please Wait. Go shoot. Away. Should I have asked? Should I have told her that Rosie is running? Something you need? Uh, like discuss the election. That's all the info I need. Uh, this Dave guy has his own museum. Oh yes. Everything here is from Dave's adventures in the wasteland before he founded the Republic. I give a tour every day starting around 2 p.m. You should stop by then. Okay. Does the museum accept donations? I'd never really thought about that before. Why do you ask? I happen to have some souvenirs from Dave's past for sale. Oh, wonderful. I'd be happy to accept your contribution on behalf of the Republic. And Dave just increased the budget for the museum this year, too. I was going to buy books for the children, but this is far more important. It is, it is, it really is. I'm ready to sell you those Dave relics. Great. What do you have? Uh, oh, and we can actually just sell her stuff. She's got 700 caps. Let's see. Items, weapons, apparel, aid. Buff out, buff out, buff out, buff out. Medex, medex, medex. Mentats, 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 mentats. Why do we have a Nuka Cola? Nuka Cola we sell. Paradise Lost. The book. Psycho, Psycho, right away. Sugar bombs. Yao Guai meat. We'll sell that. I think we got some missed stuff. Uh, Android component. Blue Pass, Bobby Pin, Brotherhood of Steel. Food sanitizer. John Wilkes Booth. Lincoln's Diary. Lincoln's Thing. Metro Ticket. Office employee. Pre war money. Oh, yeah. Where do we get those? Oh, yeah. We have to go back and check that one thing back there. Ammo. Uh, we're going big guns, aren't we? Yeah, we're going big guns. Uh, items. What else do we have? Anything? We have a couple of mini. We have multiple mini guns. We do have multiple mini guns. Okay, we'll do that. Thank you. What wonderful items for the Museum of Dave. Bye. Okay, you guys go vote. I'm gonna go check this thing back here again. We'll take all that. We'll take. Ooh, no carton of cigarettes this time. Okay, we're going to wait for her to enter, then we'll enter ourselves. There you go, sweetie. There you go, sweetie! Okay, let's wait one... Oh, yeah, we can't wait. It's so weird. One hour. Ah, Dave. Lead our republic to glory. Hello. I guess Bob has already done his thing. Don't Open even ballot box. Into that. Shut up. I can break into it if I want. Okay, can I, like... Get behind this guy and check out what he's got. He might have that ballot key. I am curious, so we're gonna make a new save here. And check what he's got. Bottle caps and 556 rounds. Okay, I'm gonna reload just in case that messes up anything. I know that it won't, most likely. Oh, and we didn't grab the bobblehead, I gotta remember too. Okay, let's see what happens. Yes. What can President Dave do for you? Hi. Uh I'd like to discuss the election. Looks like all the votes are in, Mr. President. Good. The votes are in. If you'll excuse me, I'll be getting started on tallying the numbers. Oh yes, I almost forgot. Here's your caps. Keep this up and I may deign to make you a citizen in a few years. Oh, that's so... nice of you, Mr. President. Okay, let's try to loot him. Yeah, he's only got 556 rounds of bottle caps. But why didn't you reload the save then if you did before? Well, I, yeah, I don't know. I don't know, okay? I'm going to take those. Yeah, the probably is not even worth the karma loss. Okay, I have no Let's idea who's supposed to win. A vote for me. And another vote for me. A vote for Rosie. Hmm. After counting the votes, the president is... Well, despite the hiccup, it looks like I am still declared the winner. Vote for Dave's and vote for Rosie. Interesting. Okay, so Dave, so that wasn't good. We're gonna reload this, and then when can I actually loot the ballot bo ballot box? Requires the key. He's got to open it. I think there's a way to finagle this. Yes. What? Uh, like discuss the election. Looks like all the votes are in. It gives me the caps, and then immediately we go over. Is this thing opened? Requires key. Okay, we're gonna keep checking it. And I'm gonna make a new. Eh, I'm not. Yeah, I'll make a new save here. New save. 
And we have to be hidden and pop this open as soon as it says doesn't require a key. Because he checks one vote. Hello. Let's see. Let's see what we have here. Okay, we're going to take the votes for Dave, and there's just going to be one for Rosie. Vote for me. And another vote for me. A vote for Rosie? Yes? Well, oh wait a minute. Has somebody tampered with the ballot box? Hmm. After counting the votes, the president is... Rosie? Rosie can't be president. No. This is unfair. This can't be. Fine. I'm leaving. See how you people do without me. Enjoy your new president. Oh my god, it actually worked. I'm super surprised. I guess you're wondering where I'm going. I'm off to annex old... I'm off to annex old something. It actually worked. Holy crap. Well, now, who could have ever thought? Me, president. Huh, things are really going to be different around here. Listen, I can't thank you enough. You convinced me that I could do this, and you were right. I want you to have something. Dave kept some big weapon or something locked up in the safe in his office. The code is 1138. It's yours if you want it. We don't need it anymore. Oh, is that how you get it? Oh. Detected, but it's still not letting me actually open it. There we go. So he's got steam gauge assembly. Uh, That's not a big... Is that... What? Is that what you're talking about? I don't need that. Activate ham radio. Steam gauge assembly. Yeah, I feel like this was cut or broken or something. I could be wrong. I'm just glad Rosie actually won. I just can't thank you enough. Yeah, I thought you could manipulate yeah, the the, the uh, ballot box. Dave says you're okay? Fine. Yeah, Dave doesn't run this place anymore. Have you heard that Rosie won the election? Rosie's going to be the new leader? What will Dave do? He's already headed out. He doesn't give a F about you guys. I mean, honestly, you, you should have realized that earlier, uh, to be honest with you. Man, it'd be great to actually... I, I'm sure they wanted you to actually be able to run the Republic of Dave yourself. See what Bob has to say. Rosie as president? You've got to be kidding me. You've got to be kidding me. A woman as president? What? Hi there. We're gonna grab this again. And then where is Shauna? Have you heard about We're gonna sit here. There's Shauna right there. Something you need? Uh looks like she doesn't even have anything to say. Hey okay, there. now we're gonna wait. So does so do you have old painless? I guess you're wondering where I'm going. I'm off to annex old only and forge the new Republic of Dave. Oh, <laughs> that's right. Okay, we'll meet up with him later on, most likely. Uh, let's see. Let's wait until the tour of Dave. So that's going to be 24 hours, 23. Did I say 24 and then 23? Or did I just say 23? I'm not sure regardless of what I said. Let's see. What media have I been interacting with? I finished the rehearsal on HBO. I did not like it. I did not understand it. I love Nathan for you, but I did not like the rehearsal. I also finished, uh, or I'm caught up with House of the Dragon, which I'm actually enjoying quite a bit. And currently I'm catching up with season four of Westworld, which I'm enjoying very much so far. Shauna, you say you give a thing every day at two, and yet you're never here. What are you even talking about? Okay, well, I guess we're not going to interact with that. All right, so that is all the Republic of Dave content. The one thing we missed out on was his shotgun or whatever. Um, I believe it's called Old Painless. It's like one of the best weapons in the game, if I remember correctly. Um, but where was the Washington the Museum of History is where we need to go, right? But uh, I think we can still get it, if I remember correctly. I could be wrong, but I think there's a way to still get his weapon but yeah that's all the republic of dave stuff which is pretty fun and interesting if you remember correctly uh i'm trying to think it's been so long since i recorded this series do i have a thumbnail no although this would make a good thumbnail okay so now we're doing you got to shoot him in the head where we have to return to mr crowley uh and then give him all of the keys for uh, shooting people in the head or whatever, which we did not. We we can lie about all that stuff. So hey. where is he? He's in Carol's place. And then he is over here. Hello. Are they all dead yet? Did you bring me any proof? 
Uh, let's see. Tenpenny is dead. We can talk about Strayer. Those people sent me... Those people you sent me to kill aren't ghoul haters. You weren't supposed to talk to them. You were just supposed to kill them. <sighs> okay. Okay. All I really want are those security keys. Killing them is just a bonus. Just get me the keys and I'll still pay you. I'll even throw in a hundred cap bonus. Deal? More caps? You got a deal. Good. Oh, and I still want Tenpenny dead. That bastard really does hate ghouls. Uh, let's see. Tell me where Fort Constantine is. Right. You're just a lying bigot like all humans. Gosh dang it. Uh, here's Strayer's key, but I'm afraid he's still alive. So long as I get that key, I don't care. Here's your caps. Okay, we get Ted Strayer's special key removed. We get 20, 25 caps and that's it. Here's Dukov's key. I got it without killing him. Who cares? I've got his key. That's all I really want. Here's Dave's key, but he's not dead. All I care about is the key, which I'll take now. I decided not to kill Tenpenny. He made me a better offer. Tell me where Fort Constantine is. It's pretty far away, northwest of here. Knowing won't do you any good with these keys, though. Okay, let's see. I've decided not to kill Tenpenny. Maybe a better offer. What? I hired you to kill him. I want him dead. You double-crossed me. I won't get into a bidding war with him. I'll lose. Guess I gotta kill you now. Caron, you know what to do. Opening fire. Where? Yeah, yeah. You just want to leave us alone. Critical strike on Mr. Crowley. Where is he? Right there? Who's still attacking me? Oh no, that's not good. Optional kill Mr. Crowley. Collect reward from Alistair Tenpenny. I don't want to kill everybody. Oh jeez, this didn't go the way that I wanted. No, 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 not save. Uh-uh. Load. Oh, I didn't... Ugh. Auto Carol's place, good. So, I'm not sure how this is going to work out because I don't want to kill everybody, but everybody seems to aggro onto me. And we can't... Hmm. Are they all dead yet? I put a bullet right between Ted Strayer's eyes. So the ghoul hater got what was coming to him. Good riddance. Here's your caps. I'll take that key. Ted Strayer's special key removed. How much do we get? 100 bottle caps added. Okay, I better start hunting the next one on the list. Those people you sent me aren't ghoul haters. Yep. More caps, you got a deal. Okay, uh, better start hunting the next one on the list. Okay, we're gonna try to make this happen here. New save. Do you have those keys? Let's see. Here's Dukov's key. I got it without killing him. Uh, tell me where Fort Constantine right. is, and then we fail it again. Dave's head popped like a zit. Serves him right. He won't be spreading lies about ghouls anymore. I'll take that key, and here are your caps. Thank you. Tell me where Fort Constantine right. is. We fail that as well. Decided to not kill Tenpenny, and then he just decides to kill me. Now, does that Can aggro everybody? What's going on with you? Oh, no. It does aggro everybody, but why? Oh my gosh. Why does that aggro everybody? Do you have those keys yet? Oh, town, you best be careful. Let's try this. Hey. Gotta shoot him in the head. Look out. Okay, we good? Okay, cool. That worked out. Collect reward from Alistair Tenpenny. Now, wait a second. We're gonna reload this one more time, because there's a better way to do this. Do you have those keys yet? Uh, Dukovsky got it without killing him. Tell me before constant. Right. How am I gonna fail that 67% three times in a row? Uh. That's insane. Okay, I have to go now. We're gonna make a save. Stop getting up and moving around. You did me a great favor with those. Uh huh. Wait, what? I need to get going. Wait, what even happened? This is so bizarre. I'm just gonna add these in and then continue, take whatever, done. Okay, we're gonna load this again. This is so bizarre. What is going on? We gotta do level up again? What? What?
I'm extremely confused. What is even happening? How can I get a level up? Okay, we're gonna load Carol's place. This is so weird. Hey, Don't even you. sit down. Don't even Are sit they down. All dead yet? Uh, put a bullet right between Ted Strayer's eyes. You're Okay, cool. Not yet, but I'm working on it. Tell me we're four big. Yeah, how are we gonna fail that like five times? This is insanity. Let's load this. This is insanity. Okay, I feel like are something's actually messing up with like the. the okay, yeah, forty-five percent. Good. Thank you. Uh, those people you sent aren't ghoul haters, and we get an extra caps. You got you got a deal. Okay, now better start getting the next one on the list. We're gonna save again. New save. Gonna okay, we're gonna talk to him again. Uh-huh, here's Dukov's key. I got it without killing him. Tell me where Fort Constantine is. Good. Better start hunting the next one on the list. Save again. New save. Talk to you again. Sitting down is Do annoying, but that's fine. Uh, here's Dave's key, but he's not dead. Tell me where Fort Constantine is. Decide not to kill Tunpenny. Uh-huh, that's fine. We're gonna take out our weapon. We're gonna press V. Did he go for his head? Gotta shoot him in the head. Press E. There we go. And now as long as nobody else... Why? Oh my god, this is so annoying. It's just like flipping a coin to see if, if these random things will happen or not. Do you have those keys yet? Here's Dave's key, but he's not dead. Tell me where Fort Constantine is. Decide not to kill Tenpenny. Oh my gosh, this is like so incredibly annoying. It's like flipping a coin whether or not better going down. everything goes to crap or Do not. Have those keys and sometimes he doesn't even let me, he doesn't even let me like go for the optional stuff here. Maybe it's Fort Constantine. Hey, you. I'm pressing Hi. V, hello? What the heck is happening? <laughs> Everybody chill. Everybody chill. Everybody chill. Uh, maybe if I try to just kill this guy. Optional kill Mr. Crowley. Yeah, let's try to just kill him and see if everybody gets angry at me. <sighs> what the heck, man? Hey, what's new? Do you have those keys? Yeah, decided not to kill Tenpenny. Where's Fort Constantine? Decided not to kill him. Yep, gotta kill me now. Okay, he's attacking me. He's literally... If I can kill him before... There we go. Now, maybe that'll work. Everybody chill. 44, rag 44 Magnum rounds. Bottle caps, Dave's special key, Dukov's special key, stim pack, Ted Strayer's key. Okay, exit, and as long as nobody's attacking me- WHY ARE THEY ATTACKING ME?! I'm just gonna leave. The whole place is gonna be attacking me, aren't they? I'm just leaving. Why?! This is so freaking annoying, man. Maybe we can kill him in some, like, other place. Let's see, what time is it? Okay, 6.37. What if we wait until, like, nighttime? Six hours, seven hours. I don't know how we can get away with this sometimes, but other times it doesn't work. It's just so bizarre. And I don't... I would rather just side with Mr. Crowley anyways. That's the thing. It's been a while. Okay, maybe he's in, like, his own room here. Maybe this will work. There he is. Let's see where he goes. Well, look who's back. Maybe I can, if I can get a sneak bonus on killing him so that nobody attacks me. It's been a while. What have you been up to? Okay, where does he go? Door to the ninth circle. Come on, let me get that sneak bonus on him. And then we're all freaking good. Okay, is he going to sit down? Okay, let's see. There we go. All right, we're going to make a new save. I'm going to press V. I'm going to go to Mr. Crowley. Shoot his head. It's going to bug out because nothing can be easy with this quest for some reason. Good. 
and then everyone's still gonna get mad at me. Okay, but maybe if I leave. Hey, you. Where? Where? Want some more? Maybe if I leave. Come on, Karen, let's go. Quickly now. This is so freaking weird. What what else is it telling me to do, by the way? Okay, you good? What else is it telling me to do for this quest? Collect ward, bring Dave's key to Mr. Crowley. What are you talking about? Bring Dave's key? <laughs> oh. All right, we're going to reload this, and we'll just try to figure it out. I don't... So I guess I have to... Do you have those keys yet? Here's Dave's key. Tell me where Fort Constantine is. I have to go now. Okay, and that's going to complete the quest. Quest completed, you got to shoot him in the head. Oh, okay. I could have just completed it with him instead of going to Tenpenny. I don't know why that was so confusing to me. Okay. Now, I think we get big guns up as much as possible here. We want big guns to be at 100. And then we're going to continue, and then what do we have? Looking at the bottom here. When sun is down, a night person gains two to intelligence, perception up to a maximum of 10. This perk directly affects your internal clock. Useless. Nerd rage. Useless. Wait. Strength is raised to 10. You gain 50% damage resistance whenever your health drops 20% below. Eh. Gives you an additional level immediately. First rank in animals simply won't attack. That's kind of nice. Strong bag can carry 50 more pounds of equipment. You're obsessed with really big weapons. With each rank of this perk, you gain additional 15 points to the big gun skill, but we're all, almost at max of that. Additional 25% to radiation resistance. Eh. You gain an extra 30 points of speech as long as you, you, you maintain a neutral combat level. No. Uh, your accuracy in vats is significantly increased. We're trying not to use vats. 10% overall damage resistance up to a maximum of 85%. Uh, we might be able to get the maximum of that. A gunslinger, demolition expert. All of your explosive weapons do an additional 20% damage. Definitely want that. There we go. We'll get the maximum for that. Okay, and now we can follow Mr. Crowley, who's right here. And then... Yeah, we're going to make a save because I don't remember exactly what we want to do 100%, but... We're going to make a save here and call this episode quits. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, remember leaving likes, leaving comments, subscribe with the bell turned on. It all helps out this channel and series to grow. Thank you to those who do that. Consider checking out the Patreon and Twitch links in the description below, and I will see you in the next episode. Bye-bye. Don't mess with.